A pile of waste left over from a cotton harvest caught fire several days ago, and tonight that fire is still going. Authorities say they've done all they can. Now, people nearby are sick of the smoke. Channel 5's Christian Ron Pricing tries to find out why it's taking so long to extinguish that fire. Well, this is stuff left over from the cotton harvest, a big pile the size of a football field. It caught on fire, and nearby residents say the smoke is a problem. Authorities tell us they've decided to let it burn. Tonight, off in the distance on private property, this pile keeps burning. The smoke. Very thick. You can see that it's like a fog, a haze. Priscilla Bernal's description of what it was like days ago and others. This ain't okay. It was worse. The smoke from the cotton refuse coming from behind a private fence, putting a damper on holiday gatherings. We could not be outside. Um, the smoke was inside the homes, in, on your clothing, on the car. <laughs> Bernal's aunt Leanne, while showing us around, couldn't take the smoke. Coughing, she got back in the car, her husband. And the last past two weeks, we could barely breathe out there. Bernal say it's been going on for four weeks. Authorities say they were notified this week. It's long as a football field, which is 100 yards, and it is approximately 15 feet high. We did send uh, some personnel out there. The Hidalgo County Fire Marshal says it went out to take a look and to make sure the fire wasn't spreading to other properties. The Mercedes Fire Department says it worked to put out the fire because of smoke complaints. We've put well over 12,000 gallons of water on it in the last three days and been unsuccessful being able to uh, extinguish the fire. Both the Hidalgo County Fire Marshal and the Mercedes Fire Department told us today they thought the International Boundary and Water Commission was responsible for the property. The IBWC tells us they leased the land from a private landowner. The Mercedes Emergency Management Coordinator says a pile of cotton refuse was stored on this land. He says the fire broke out spontaneously. This stuff is really thick. It's got a lot to it. You can see how a big pile of it would take a long time to burn. We're going to do everything that we can to make sure that any applicable laws are followed. Until now, the county hasn't issued any penalty. Do something about it because we can't take it. People are waiting for the fire to die out. The Mercedes Emergency Management Coordinator says responders put down water and cut the pile of cotton in half when they went out there this week. Their hope is to cut down the time it'll take for the pile to stop burning. We're working to find out who owns the land. None of the people we talked to today knew exactly who that private landowner is. For now, that fire will keep burning. In the studio, Christian Von Pricing, Channel 5 News at 6.